Hello, my name is Tony, and welcome back to episode 2 of Athoscraft. Today, uh, I want to begin looking at this. So we actually have a lot of work to get done today, but uh, oh, let's first investigate and see what this is all about, shall we? So uh, it looks like someone has built a sleigh. There appears to be a chest here. Some coal. Oh no, that doesn't sound good at all. Uh, okay. <laughs> to Tony, aka the Grinch. What? No! <laughs> I'm not the Grinch. Merry Christmas from Beach Santa. P.S. In Australia, Santa uses kangaroos, not reindeer. Okay, interesting. Oh my goodness. Have you got something at the end here as well? Bar humbug. Oh goodness me. Alright, so it looks like I've been hit from, I'm assuming, Ash Kiwi and probably Darth as well. He, he probably played a part in this. Um, goodness me. So yeah, I made I made I made the passing comment that starting the new season that I didn't think there would be time for Christmas, or at least not a big Christmas anyway, is what I said. Uh, and so I would probably have to scale back and have a smaller Christmas. Uh, it seems that people have taken that a little bit too strongly and disagree with my sentiment. So yes, okay, fair enough. Well, I think I'll leave this here for now for purple to see if she hasn't seen it already goodness me all right well anyway from there i think the first call today is to go into the nether i want to grab some various pieces from the fortress in there uh for our villagers and for other various pieces as well and uh, yeah so i'll be heading in there now i'll see you in a bit all right and with this last bucket of lava we should be just about there with this portal Okay, and then we place this here, bucket of water there, and there we go. Let's go ahead and remove this dirt. And there we go. One portal frame. I think it's just missing something that obviously, um, well, other than the fact that it's missing the actual portal itself, because we can't actually uh, go anywhere just yet. But. We're missing, there's something missing from this, so hang on. Alright, and then one, two, three, four. There we go. Looking much nicer. Alright, so we've got a portal ready. Now I just need to go ahead and light it, and then we can head into the nether. Alright, so I'm all geared up now. I got my shield, got my gold armor, got some gold, various other bits and pieces I think I'm gonna need. And I'm just quickly cooking up some food real quickly and then we can head on in. Alright, so we've cooked food in hand. Let's go ahead and activate this portal. There we go. Bow at the ready. Well actually let's get sword at the ready. And uh, in we go. Wish me luck! All right, we're in the nether. We appear to be in the roof. Okay, well, this might take a while for me to get where I need to go. Uh, thankfully, uh, I have the needed resources. So uh, I guess I'll tune back to you when I found uh, what I'm looking for. Ooh, blaze. Do I attempt just falling down here? It's going to be like five block damage, probably. No, screw it. One heart damage, that's fine. Ooh, ow. Ow. <gasps> oh, no. Oh, no. Oh, no. Oh, my goodness. Okay, well, that's my first official death. We'll have to go and try and get our stuff back. Hopefully we don't die even more, but we'll see. All right, so I finished for now grabbing some blaze rods. As you can see here, I managed to get 19, but those blazes are hard, man. They're really, really hard. I don't remember them being that very difficult. Uh, to be fair, they used to only just fly about and, you know, just shoot from a distance. But this time I've had them chasing me. Like they were coming right at me and I was taking lots of levels of damage. I'm gonna need some better armor, some better gear. So uh, yeah, I don't know what I'm gonna do just yet, but we'll probably come back this way in a sec and see if we can try and get some uh, never what. All right, well, uh, I think I'm gonna stop going into the never now because oh my God, I don't remember it being that difficult. 
Uh, maybe it's been some time since I've been really exploring in the Nether. I don't know. Maybe I, I'm just, I just don't remember it, it being that hard. But you know, I have 16 blaze rods in here. And also if I check down over here, I've got another 19 here. So I've got a total of 35 blaze rods, which means, you know, that's plenty for all of our brewing needs and other things. And also enough to probably get a few eyes of enders going as well. Now I just need to focus on trying to get some pearls. And also I'm still in need of never wood. All right, so it's the next day and I've got myself a diamond sword with sharpness three maybe that might help me this time in taking out some of the blazes and it looks like purple's done a bit of renovation changes to the house she's moved our beds up here and i'll just make sure i've got our spawn point set i do so this time i want to tackle again the fortress i want to try and see if we can get some never what we really really need with never what so wish me luck oh <gasps> job's head and never what well my head now Missing successful, and I hear death all around me. All right, we did it. We did it. I came back, and I found some never what. A bunch of other things as well. I found Job's head, which uh, we're going to go ahead and add that to our head collection. And we also picked up some other little bits, some more blaze powder and such. I couldn't find any piglins, though, so that's that's uh, one thing. Now that we've done that, I think I'm going to go and see what Purple was up to, and uh, maybe we'll try and see what we can uh, work on next. Now that we've got some stuff to actually work on villagers, maybe that might be what we do next. All right, so I am here with Purple now. She is just currently working on clearing out some of the sand area, and I'm going to help her clear it out as well so our mission is to get the two villagers we have over here into a house so that we can start working on breeding them so i'm gonna help her out on that and work on the house and we'll probably i'll probably be back once uh, we've got something uh, concrete all right so we have finished working on the house for the villagers to stay in uh it's just a little basic house you know nothing too fancy or anything you know uh it's nothing like our house over there but uh you know it meets uh, the needs of what we want it to do we've now gone ahead and moved our villagers which are right here and we put them as fletchers so the idea is now we can trade them to get some emeralds and uh, begin working on getting some more traders along the way which uh, we've actually started doing already down over here so we've got uh, some armorers over here to start getting some diamond gear which as you can see from earlier I'm in half a set at the moment enchantments are not great you know protection two blast protection three you know they're not they're not necessarily great protections necessarily but they're nice nonetheless and uh, so far we have the chest plate and the leggings and i'm just trying to get the other two we've got the the boots but we didn't get the helmets so we've got another guy here and i'm hoping i can level him up enough to get a helmet ideally if he has either a helmet and leggings or a helmet and boots, then I can probably kill off one of these guys because he has already got the chest plate and he's already got the chest plate. So kind of no matter what one he gets, as long as he doesn't get a chest plate, I can probably kill off one of these. So we can just keep it to just the two of them. And then beyond that, I think we're looking at some librarians maybe. Then we probably might get a farmer or two in here and probably some tool people as well so we can get some tools. And I think that's probably going to be it for this building, I think, for now. I will be doing some more work in here another time. For now, I think we're going to end it there. Uh, I'm going to be trying to continuing on the villagers here. They're going to take a little while, I think, to get to where I want them to be. I also hope to get a... Uh, iron farm built. I think I'll probably build it out in the ocean over here. Or lake. Lake. Get it right. <laughs> out in the lake here. Yeah. And then that way we can get an iron farm going and some more village tradings as well. So yes, that'll be it for today. Hope you enjoyed and I'll be seeing you guys in another video. Bye bye.